Just days before people are set to go to Jack's Beach to celebrate the 4th of July, two people hit by cars in that area. And this is video from one of them. This happened near the Seawalk Pavilion. And now let's take a live look from Sky Action News Jack's over the area. This is just a few blocks away from where that crash happened. I'm Tanika Hughes. And I'm Ben Becker. Action News Jack's Bridget Matters live at Jack's Beach. And Bridget, you rode with an officer this morning. And if you've ever been to Jack's Beach during 4th of July, Ben and Tanika, you know how busy it can be. Just over the weekend in front of Surfer Bar, a woman was hit while she was walking across the street. It's a reminder officers want to use to tell pedestrians and drivers to be safe this holiday. Meet Officer Andrew Lavender. I'm a good adapter, man. A police officer for 29 years. Since 1990, I've been out here. You can find him in Jack's Beach. Today, he found a man who had taken a bad fall and needed help. He came down off the step. Lavender sure might go. even pull you over. So just friendly warning. Just, uh, what you might want to do is check and make sure all your fuses are, fit, are, are working. He's worked 4th of July almost every year. While some years are quiet, others have been tragic. Very unfortunately, I've had uh, traffic fatalities wherein pedestrians have been hit coming back across 3rd Street following the fireworks. Since Sunday, police say a woman walking was hit by a car near Surfer Bar. This is viewer video of rescue helping the woman. On Monday, a bicyclist was hit by a truck. Both are expected to survive. Lavender says many pedestrians aren't paying attention, and that can be deadly once 4th of July events are over and right. streets are flooded. But instead of going to a designated crosswalk, they're crossing over the, the large medians. Lavender says use the crosswalks and be mindful of drivers who might not be paying attention. Jack's Beach PD says roads will close at some point 4th of July, but it will depend on traffic. Either way, Lavender will be there. Yeah, tempo. And next at 6, we're getting an inside look at Jack's Beach PD's command center, the dozens of cameras that they'll be using 4th of July to keep you safe. In Jack's Beach, Bridget Matters, CBS 47, Action News Jack.